One of the largest hidden gems of Fort Dodge is our very own Fort Museum in Frontier Village, which was established in 1964. It is a wonderful reflection of the great frontier heritage of this community, something in which every citizen is able to benefit from. We can all take a great deal of pride in having it located within our community. I've been pleased to hear countless positive compliments about our Fort Museum in Frontier Village from the many out-of-area visitors who come to visit this community's hidden historical gem. We've also had visitors from several different European countries and they all were pleasantly surprised to see how unique we are from everything else they've seen. Each season we welcome Civil War buffs who are excited to discover the only remaining building in existence in which Brevet Major Louis A. Armistead served, an original 1850 building here within the stockade. Armistead was wounded at the Battle of Gettysburg while leading Confederate General Pickett's charge on the third day of battle, succumbing to his wounds a couple of days later. He is among the most famous and revered of fallen Civil War heroes. We have an outstanding collection of Indian artifacts within the East Exhibit Building within the fort, many of them found locally. Also included are outstanding exhibits of our frontier past, plus Civil War and Spanish-American War artifacts, and personal items from William Williams and his family. A great collection of Fort Dodge stoneware and White's pottery are also on display. The Fort Dodge Coin Club has recently created the great new exhibit for us of historical coins and currency. The Cardiff Giant exhibit contains our version of the largest hoax perpetrated on the American people in the 1800s. The huge block of gypsum from which the Cardiff Giant was carved originated in Fort Dodge. The fake petrified man fooled millions of people, both amateur and expert alike. Our very own Frontier Village contains 11 different buildings packed with corresponding articles appropriate to each building. Several of these buildings are originals, moved to the site. Others are exact replicas of original buildings from the area. We have a superb collection of buggies and other horse-drawn equipment. We are always very interested in acquiring more articles for our displays. We recently opened a new World War II and World War I military display room, which has a world-class selection of female military uniforms and many other unusual items. A large percentage of these articles had never been on display before, since being donated years ago. The Fort Museum in Frontier Village is owned and operated by the Fort Dodge Historical Foundation, a private nonprofit corporation. We do not receive money from the state of Iowa or from Webster County or from the city of Fort Dodge. We rely upon memberships, admission fees, and private donations.